Here we are at the Geneva Concours, August 26, 2018, uh, with the Chrysler 300s featured today. First, we've got Steve Southwell's Hearst Chrysler 300. Beautiful car. Sorry. This Chrysler was six thousand dollars. Hagerty's been a wonderful partner of our show. Now we go over to the circle now. here, and, I'd like and to we've got the 1955 Chrysler 300s, the C300s. Got platinum of the Bob Letter collection, and then black out of the Canals Motor Selection Collection. Rick Larson brought that car in, and the Bob Lutz Tango Red. And then we go over to the line of great letter cars. 55 or 56 300B brought up by Mark Oberman from Niles, Illinois. With the torque flight, beautiful interior, beautiful black car, 56 tail. And Wayne Kaczynski's 57 300C convertible from Ann Arbor, Michigan. Concourse. Current Chrysler Cup Award owner. Car is still looking great. Fifty seven, the all new design. And Terry and Chloe Berg's 57 Chrysler 300 that Terry's father bought brand new locally here in Berkeley, Illinois. Cars had a little bit of resto work done, but mostly original. Beautiful C convertible again. And Keith Boonstra's and Judy Boonstra's Gaugan Red 57 C Coupe. They drove in from Holland, Michigan yesterday. Hello. <laughs> and a beautiful 392 Hemi. Those 57 air cleaners. Hello, Randy. Did you see Fran Trost? 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 What is it? Yeah, I saw Trost. I just was walking around putting these on people's, so I just looked in his back seat. Uh huh. I didn't do that. Somebody set a ice cream and it's tipped over and it's melting all over his seat. It's plastic. He does that. He put that on my car last week. Look in there and like, oh, Jesus. No, it's his uh, sense of humor. You know, it's similar to yours probably. <laughs> you could take it out and put it on yours if you want. People will die, I know. 58 300D convertible, Matador Red. Bob Brown, George Collar. Bob brought it down from Wisconsin Rapids yesterday. 
very rare car. Not too many deconvertibles still hanging out there. So it's just terrific that this car is here and it's got the record player. Beautiful D, and now we've got the D Coupe. Daryl and Rita Miller drove up from Normal, Illinois. Yeah, it's a Hemi. With the 58 taillights. Beautiful Tahitian coral color. I got it. Daryl. <laughs> the pastel colors, the Gaugan red, Titian coral. Absolutely beautiful demonstration of the 1950s. And here we have the rarest car here, 300E convertible. Bob Brown, George Collar, Bob brought it down from Wisconsin Rapids yesterday. It's even got the autopilot. Beautiful E convertible. First year of the swivel seats. So, really cool feature, push buttons, of course, 56 to 64, and 300 emblem on the side of the hood, and the red anodized grill. Some people love them, some people hate them, I actually love it. Twenty-one of these cars still estimated to be known to exist out of 125 originally produced. And the 59 300E uh, coupe brought by Guy Maurice lives locally here. Guy's had this car for many years. Beautiful radiant red. The new hubcaps and the radiant red paint with the ra with the red uh, anodized grill. Absolutely spectacular presentation. See the blower? Yep. Okay, see the blower yep. is yep. under there that speaker is. thing there, and the thing goes there, and the other one's a speaker. Oh, so that's see? an intake for the thing. That's an intake for the motor. Yeah, that's what that one is. Okay. Is that the standard air setup guy for 59? Uh, well, this doesn't have air. Okay. Yeah, I forgot the rear window, rear window defroster. Once you okay. grill, there's an air intake for the blower motor, and you got a hose that runs to that. The outlet in the middle. There. I see it. Okay. And the other thing is, is just a radio speaker. Okay. <laughs> kind of fake you out. Yeah. <laughs> this is a uh, formerly Toyador uh, Red F convertible owned by Ken Nagel. Now kind of a plum color. And here is Randy Geyer's spectacular black 300 F convertible. The last 300 F convertible to come off the assembly line. In all its glory. Brett, Sally, you got rid of uh, Randy? He's not recruiting for the Concord. Okay, passing out his books, yeah, yeah. Randy will be hosting our fall 2019 Chrysler 300 Club meet in uh, 
Minnetonka, Lake Minnetonka, Minnesota. So look forward to seeing a lot of you up there. Again, this car was the last 300F convertible produced, highly loaded with options, just a spectacular restoration. And here we have Frank Troost's Terracotta 300F Coupe. Yeah, they call those the toilet seat. The toilet seat, I'm telling you. Frank's car is here locally. Beautiful example of a 300F coupe. And Frank's sense of humor, his plastic ice cream cup with the spilled ice cream on his back seat. And now the 300G. John Beejan's 300G convertible from Saline, Michigan, job, job in yesterday. Uh, this beautiful car, absolutely spectacular paint job, spectacular presentation. Um, this is the car John and I cruised tandem in, me and my 300F convertible, and John, I mean, Cooper and John and his 300F uh, convertible. Out to White Sands, New Mexico a few years ago to the meet out there and last year to Geneva, New York and to Lynchburg, Virginia and we'll be leaving in a couple weeks and cruising out to the Newport, Rhode Island meet. Beautiful cross ram. Just a beautiful car. Had this car parked in my garage last night next to mine and there couldn't be a better garage uh, photo than, than those two cars parked together. And here we have Brian Franks, beautiful black 300G coupe from suburban Milwaukee. Brian drove in yesterday, or this morning actually. So, there's the poster for Brian. I think this is a pretty And here's the poster for John's car. And Henry Bannix, 50 or 62 300H convertible, beautiful 300H. Henry brought it in from Indiana this morning. Thrilled that he could come. Unfortunately, couldn't find a 300H coupe, but Henry's representing with this beautiful example of the H convertible taillights are in remarkably good condition as those typically would milk out, and crack and fade. Beautiful interior. And a beautiful front end on the 62. Mark Oberman and his 300J coupe. All original interior, claret red interior, claret paint. Very clean looking design. Not the uh, Virgil Exner design that we were accustomed to for the last several years, but still a beautiful car. And then we get into the 1964 300Ks. John, or Don Nissen from West Suburban River Forest, Illinois, brought his beautiful 300K convertible. It's a single four barrel car, doesn't have the optional cross ram. That beautiful front end that the Ks had. Rare production, only 625. 300K convertibles. 
just the pinstriping down the side there was a bigger a cleaner look than the wider uh, trim they had on the 300 sports and then we have our 300 K coupe brought here from Donnie Carr who lives a few miles away from here in southwest far southwest suburban Chicago area I met Donnie with this car a few years ago to cruise night in Seneca, Illinois. And it's a beautiful car. This again is a single four barrel car, not a Ram car. Uh, and we were supposed to have 1965 300L convertible today, but Roland Westra fell ill so couldn't bring that. So we have all the 55 through 64s represented, missed the 65, but what an absolute stunning display of cars. First of the mark. What a legend. Delta wing air cleaner, big 331 cubic inch, powerful V8, and the 6 volt battery still in place. 